So we're doing today, oh, ready? Okay, so you're gonna color right here. Color right over here. And then on this one as well. Okay, so what we're doing is we're doing um, arrow, like green arrows. So basically, it's gonna be using um, crystal board here as well as a stick. A miniature version of this. There we go. And basically, um, we're having the kids color and we're putting it together for them. They can take it all. So any, anybody can, can do it? Anybody. Anybody. Oh, yeah. So for the kids, we're just having them color. Oh, okay. And then, Sorry. Yeah, we're just, um, if any, we're helping them put it together as well so they kind of see what the finished product is. Oh, oh, are you all done? Cut out. Yeah. Okay, let me put it together. Oh, 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 probably one for you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. This product just different. Yeah, different. Guardian of the Galaxy, oh, these are just characters. Oh, okay. Just put together. So okay. It's on the wrong side. Oh, so okay. So okay. Okay. Explain Capicurra. Okay, okay. Yeah. okay. You want to I'm a Halo 4 Spartan. Okay. I'm explaining on how to make your own costume. Okay, Tapakua is, you download the software online. You have these templates that you can print out and download. You may glue it, assemble it all together into this. Apply resin on the outside and inside. Maybe some fiberglass. Add some bondo. Makes this. You could probably install electronics if you want or Arduino board, make it even better. And then final product. It's a very long process. You have to use resin on the outside, very light coats, and then on the inside. After a few more coats on the outside and inside, you apply fiberglass resin. And then from there, once it's solidified and sealed, you apply bondo on the outside, sand it down, apply more bondo until you get the right shape. When you finally got it, spray it down with primer, spray it with paint, install the electronics if you wish, or any other things. So your entire suit is paint? Pretty much. Lexin for the visor, um, cardstock 110 pound, resin, fiberglass, bondo, various layers of paint. I got a fan in here with um, batteries, motocross compression suits, regular um, <laughs> Under Armour compression <laughs> pants and stuff. I know, right? <laughs> I'm also using um, knee pads for extra bulk. Awesome. Right. still dry, so it might take a while to. Hello. Yeah, but the glue is still drying. We are informing Thank you for coming. What 2D? Yeah, the glue is still drying, so it So you can make full costumes like this from 2D objects like paper, okay, or foam, or cardstock, and then you just fold them together to make various cosplays. So this is made out of paper tubes and. Uh, the foam and paper and then you just paint it and it's a cheap way of making costumes without having to pay like thousands of it like this so this is considered 2d so there's this plane and this plane and then when you fold it over and make a third plane that's how you make it into a 3d object so you go from this to this okay oh one more yep that that's it. I mean, that's as simple as it gets. 